Hey guys, I'm Suleiman Khan. As you can see on the screen, we have this rise fall table, which calculates all the reduced levels for each point. What you have to do is just to provide the back side, enter side, and then the fore side for your survey, okay? This Excel sheet, or you can say this table, will calculate all the videos for you, okay, automatically. And the, the thing which I really like about this table is actually the calculation check. As you can see, in the calculation, we have these three videos, okay? These are the same. If these three videos are the same, it means the calculation is just okay, okay? If one video is just different from the rest, it means that something is wrong with the calculation. Okay, let's just change other videos, maybe the enter sites, okay? You can you can provide videos for the enter site, for the four site, okay? Uh, these are actually the videos which are, you can say, the stop readings. Maybe when you take readings on the stop, they are just named with back side, enter side, and fore side. If you don't know about these readings, a separate video is already been uploaded in the same channel. You can watch that, no problem, okay? You can change all the videos, no problem. Okay, you can see them. And as you can see in the calculation, check the videos update, you can say, and these are the same videos. It means the calculation is just okay. So how can you make, or how can you create the same Excel sheet for yourself, okay? Never ask me for the same Excel sheet in the comment section, because I want you to create it by yourself, okay? Now, I'm going to delete all these videos so you can create it by yourself. Just watch the video till end. And as you can see, the benchmark, okay? The first reading, or you can say the benchmark is always known, okay? Let me just delete that for the first time, maybe for this time, okay? So let's just say we have point numbers. You can say we have different points. And let me just do it with Excel really quickly. We have nine points. You can just increase them, does not matter, okay? This time, I don't want the video to be longer, so let's say we have nine readings taken on the staff rod. Remember, the first reading which is taken on the staff rod that is known by the back side. Let's say that is just 1.122, okay? No problem. And this is metric, you can say, okay? Now, the reading which is taken, uh, you can say the first reading that is always taken at the benchmark. So the benchmark is a point whose you can say elevation is known okay so this time let's say the elevation of the first reading that is known and it's 100 let's just say we have enter side and that is 1.233 okay and again we have 2.456 no problem you can put your videos randomly if you are practicing if you have real videos you can just put them over here no problem and then we have you can say the four side and the remaster, as you can see, we have CP, which means change point, okay? The, you can say the, the, the machine is just shifted from one place to another, okay? And after four sides, remember, we always take back side. And let's say that is 1.666, no problem. Let me just do it a little bit quickly so we can save time. Now, the last reading is always the four side. And let's say that is 2.567. As you can see, the calculation check that is okay, okay? All the point, point you can say numbers are all the readings are minus 1.235. It means the calculation is okay. Now, how do you calculate all the, these things, okay? Let me just delete the remaining, you can say the rise and fall, and then the RLs. Now, remember, the rise can be actually the back side minus the enter side, okay? You must know the calculation manually before creating the Excel sheet for yourself, okay? If you want to calculate or learn the same Excel, I mean the same table manually, the video is already been uploaded to the same channel, okay? There's just the manual calculation and how do you calculate the rise file, uh, you can say for each reading and then the reduce levels for each reading, okay? That's manual calculation. Uh, I'll just provide the link in the description for the same video, okay? Now, let's just calculate the rise for each point and then we will calculate the falls and then the reduced level. That's just simple. Now, okay, I'll just provide some conditions. Let's say we have function equal and I'll just provide f this time. Now, f back side, okay, let me just say equal and then we will start a bracket and I'll say if the back side is greater than the enter side, then of course you can fill rise uh, you can say the, the kind of rise or maybe the cell of the rise, okay? So if just satisfy the, the same conditions, comma, give me the back side minus enter side, okay? 
if it does not satisfy the same conditions then comma give me the value of zero okay close the bracket and then enter okay so, something is wrong over here as you can see we have the if functionality so let's provide if over there okay now press enter as you can see this is zero now again i'll just pro, uh, provide the same functionality with equal let's say if and then i'll start a bracket you can say and uh, if back side is just less than because this is file then the enter side okay if it is the same thing then just you can give me uh back side minus enter side in the same cell okay or give me zero otherwise no problem and press enter as you can see this is file because enter side is just a maximum video than the you can say back side okay so enter side is just more back side is just less okay so let's just say if we have again if you don't know i'll just start it again if we will start a bracket if enter side is greater then the enter side comma give me the subtraction of enter side minus enter side otherwise give me video of zero close the bracket and then enter okay make sure you know everything manually so you can understand the excel sheet okay now let's just say equal if start the bracket enter side is less than this enter side then of course you can give me the subtraction of enter side minus this enter side otherwise give me video of zero okay close the bracket and then boom that's done okay you can also drag this formula because the other enter side is the same okay as you can see we have rise because this enter side is just more than this one okay maximum you can say now do it the same thing for this one or uh, let me just say equal if this enter side is greater than the four side then of course you can give me this minus you can say this one okay otherwise give me video of zero and close the bracket as you can see we have the rise we will do the same for the fall okay equal if we'll start a bracket if this inter side is less than the four side then of course give me the video of this minus this four side otherwise give me the video of zero okay so these are actually conditional okay and that's done pretty cool okay so we have the rise file up to point eight then the rl is just very simple you can say okay now let's start again okay because we have another back side so we will say if we will start a bracket and then let's say a back side is greater than the enter side then of course give me the video for back side minus enter side otherwise give me zero okay that's done pretty cool okay and do it the same you can say the same thing for the file okay equal if you will start a bracket back side is less than the enter side then of course give me this minus enter side otherwise give me video for the zero you can say okay you can put any other thing okay instead of zero you can say something maybe alphabets no problem uh, let me just do the remaining very quickly we'll start a bracket and then the enter side if it's less than the four side then you can fill the same cell with this minus this one or otherwise just enter the video for zero maybe and then close the bracket okay okay once you have the rise and fall for each point then we can calculate the rl or reduce level of each point okay just very simple you can provide equal then start the bracket you have to just mention the the first rl okay you can say this cell and then you can add the rise okay for that you can say plus and just specify this cell which is of course the rise and then you can subtract the file but there we have already a you can say a symbol of minus that means the videos are negative so i'm gonna add them too okay so plus the files and then close the bracket boom that's done okay you can drag the formula you can apply the formula to all the other cells maybe okay so this is something pretty cool and as you can see the the check 
it's also okay as you can see but this time you don't know about the check okay so let me just remove all these things okay because you have no idea about the checks now for the checks as you can see we we need the some of the the back sides you can say for that i can use the the quick summation tool as you can see i can just drag that over there so it can give me the the sum of back sides then the we need the sum of four sides okay and let's just apply the summation functionality again till that one and then we need of course the the sum of rise you can click that okay the sum of rise and then the sum of file you can say home and there we have the summation and those are the sum of files okay now let's just go to the check okay i'm going to delete these things so you can understand them now sum of back side minus sum of four side it means you can put the equal sign then start a bracket if you don't start a bracket does not matter okay the sum of back side these are the back sides and we will subtract the you can say four sides okay this is the summation and then press enter no problem next we have the sum of rise plus the sum of fall okay so let's say equal these are the rises and we will add the the files you can say okay that's done okay it's the same value as you can see these two cells are the same now the last rl minus the first rl equal this is the last rl and we will subtract the first rl which is 100 and bam as you can see these three values are the same this is how you can create an excel sheet for yourself okay the excel sheet can be longer longer okay up to many values maybe 1000 2000 does not matter okay so you have to create it by yourself and this is it this is how you can calculate okay in the remas bm means benchmark cp means the change point and this is the last reading okay